Matt Step, Dave Campbell's Texas Football back here in Clear Spring, Clear Creek ISD Stadium, Veterans Memorial Stadium, here with the head coach of the 7-0 Dickinson Gators, Coach John Snelson. Uh, now that, sound, that sounds good, doesn't it? Yes, sir. Absolutely. All right, Coach, uh, you know, big win here, 55-14 over Clear Falls, but somebody would look at, the, look at the final score and think you guys just breezed. But Clear, Fall, Clear Falls came out in the first quarter, kind of punched you guys in the mouth. How happy were you that your kids showed, some, uh, showed, showed, be, showed being able to respond to a little adversity? Real happy. You know, was not real – Pleased with our uh, lack of in intensity right off the bat, but uh, Clear Falls did a good job, man. They they just came out, took it right to us, you know. But our kids answered, it and uh, proud of them for that. Your quarterback, uh, Mike Welch, you told me pregame he, he he's special, and I. I would agree. Uh, for, for someone who hasn't seen him play or maybe someone who's hoping to see him play in the playoffs, what, what makes him a special player and what's so key to your offense? Well, he's a coach's kid, and he grew up in the field house, you know, and so he understands protocol, procedures. He, he's been in our offense a long, long time, um, and he's just very efficient. You know, we uh, the wind was really, really blowing heat over – threw some passes whenever the wind was off in our back, but he did a good job of drilling some deep balls and some intermediate balls off into the wind. Uh, just just does a good job of taking taking care of the football and um, taking what the defense gives him. I was just saying, this, he looked like he was almost better going against the wind. He really he threw a couple of great deep balls. He showed a lot of touch, and you got a lot of playmakers. And I know as a coach, it, it makes you comfortable when you've got multiple guys who can make plays and defenses just can't scheme to stop one guy, doesn't it? Yes, sir. You know, uh, Daryl Darryl Harris, our wide receiver, is having a big year because people are double teaming our tight end, Jalen Watermeyer. You know, Jalen's such a – special talent that uh you know people are just taking taking him away and mike's doing a great job of not not trying to force it in there to him and and uh daryl's been the benefactor so far your defense uh really after, after the after clear falls came out and got a couple of big plays they really settled in and, and made some plays uh obviously i know that speed is the name of the game and you guys have a, have a lot of speed on the defensive side of the ball but i, I like how they play with an edge and they kind of they kind of play old school defense don't they no doubt you know Defense has been and always will be the backbone of our program. And Coach Crooms and our defensive staff do, does a great job of preaching total relentless effort. And our uh, kids buy into that, you know. And we, uh, Claire Falls came out, punched us in the face, you know. And, and uh, you know, kids dug down deep and got after them a little bit. So, really, really happy about that. Coach, appreciate your time. Uh, congrats on the win. Uh, congrats on the great start to the year, and uh, good luck. And maybe we'll see you down the road come playoff time. Absolutely. P appreciate you coming down here to southeast Texas. Thanks, Coach. Appreciate you.